Right, what's up? I haven't reacted to anything in like four months because uh, I'm a lazy piece of shit. Uh, but basically what I've done is I've gone on Radiohead on Spotify, looked up what uh, what other people who listen to Radiohead like because I thought I'd branch out and Joy Division come up. I've heard this name from uh, people that I know talk about them, they like them. I have never listened to uh, a song that they've made in my life and all I can assume is that they must be in some way similar to Radiohead. Uh, that's all I have to go off. So we are literally uh, just gonna listen to their most streamed song, which seems to be their most streamed by far, which is Love Will Tear Us Apart. Uh, some recent remaster. I mean, that must mean they're fucking... Give me information on the right about this. Right, when did this... Right, England. Cool. 80s. Melancholy alternative. Yeah, okay. Right, so it could be the fact that Radiohead kind of got some inspo from this. Maybe. I mean, that'd be cool. Yeah, mainly uh, a London uh, listener base. I mean, listen, we're going to check it out. I might love it, I might hate it, uh, I'm gonna be honest either way, so we'll just, uh, check this shit out, let's go. I actually have no idea what to expect, kinda sounds like Break the Chain. Yeah, this feels 80s for sure. I don't know why, but this the the melody in the background it rings a bell. Maybe I have heard this somewhere. Am I weird if, uh, to say this kind of reminds me of the Smiths? Um, in no way, except for just uh, the vocalist, how it sounds. I mean. I guess they were a similarish time, I mean Smiths would have been a bit after, right? so, so I guess maybe. This is definitely catchy though. If you've seen any of my other reactions as well, I'm a big fan of drums in anything. And I'm liking these drums. I like something I can tap to. Although I won't be tapping here because it will fuck up the audio. We just know I want to. But this, this really does um, have the distinct sound of that era, the 80s. There are a lot of songs that kind of sound like this. Well, I mean, which is a good thing, do you know what I mean? It's a good sound. I'm liking the synths in the background as well, that I'm matching the, uh, the melody of the vocals. Whoever's on guitar as well is doing a great job.
Right, that's about it. Um, before we get into my synopsis of my reaction, uh, you know, I've started doing a song recommendation every video. And today's song recommendation is... I mean, I'm literally just, just going to think of it on the fly. Um, the song recommendation is Murphy's Law by Marlon Funaki. Uh, this is a song that was on my Spotify Weekly Recommended the other day. Listen to it. It's an amazing track. It's it's a very atmospheric, uh, purely instrumental track. But um, I don't see any type of person that could dislike it. So I'll put it on screen and you guys can check it out. I will say, first thoughts, there wasn't anything in the track that majorly stood out by I don't think this is the type of song where they necessarily had to be I think you can tell what they were going for and I think they definitely accomplished that they def this is definitely an earworm type of track with that repeating chorus you know love will tear us apart I feel like if I listen to this a couple more times that's definitely gonna get stuck in my head um that was good I to be honest i I wouldn't say amazing. And again, I always re-listen to these songs multiple times after I react. And, you know, I'll let you guys know if I change my mind. I, I think it was a I think it was a good track. I think I think it was decent. I don't think it was amazing. I'd probably give it like a a seven out of ten. I mean, not bad by any means. There's no disadvantages whatsoever. But um nothing just really stood out for me. But I do like the sound, the atmosphere, the vibe, the aesthetic sort of thing that I feel this band has to offer. If this does well, uh, I don't know, maybe drop another song, drop another album for these people, I don't know, whatever. I mean, if it gets suggested, um, I mean, yeah, uh, if you want any of that, uh, stick it in the comments. I'll read all of them because, I mean, <laughs> let's be honest, there's not much to read. But yeah, that's about it. I'll see you in the next one.